Screenshots are something that we take for granted until we really need to take one on the device and for people who have recently shifted to Macs, screen shot taking procedure may become a bit alien for them as there are multiple ways of taking screenshots on Macs. Screenshots can be used to create documentation, presentation or in fact to troubleshoot a problem on your device and you can also share content on social media. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you how you can take screenshots on Mac with different method so basically this video is a full to guide of how to take screenshots on mac so make sure you don't miss out on any points and watch this video till the end so there are multiple variants of screenshot you can capture on your mac either it could be full screen or partial or windowed so let's start with the full screen screenshot so it's quite easy all you have to do is just Press Command, Shift and 3 and your screen will be captured and this captured screenshot will be saved on your desktop by default. So now let's talk about what if you want to capture a particular area of your screen then what? And in that case you need to press Command, Shift and 4. As soon as you press this combination you can see on your display that the cursor will change into a crosshair and now you can select a particular area for your screenshot. And again this screenshot will be saved on your Mac's desktop. But now what if you want to take a screenshot of a particular window on your Mac and in that case you need to press Shift Command 4 plus space. As soon as you press this combination the arrow cursor will change into a camera icon and now you can select a window you want a screenshot of. And similarly this screenshot will also be saved on your Mac's desktop by default. So these are the methods you can use to capture screenshot on your Mac but if you are like me who wants to be a pro in taking screenshots on your Mac then my friend your best friend is screenshot toolbar and how to access it all you need is press shift command and five so pressing this combination will activate screenshot toolbar on your screen and from which you can take multiple types of screenshot in fact you can also start a screen recording and there are multiple options available in that toolbar to edit the preferences for your screenshot there is another way you can access the screenshot toolbar for that you need to open spotlight search by pressing command and space and search for screenshot open screenshot app and, and there you go friends, there is the screenshot toolbar. Similarly, there are multiple options of screen recording as well. But if you want me to cover that topic in separate video, do let me know in the comment section. Moving forward, there is a section called options in that toolbar. We'll talk about it later in this video. So make sure you watch it till the end. Okay, so let's sum it up. There are three actions you need to keep in mind. And that is shift plus command plus three for full screen screenshot. Shift plus command plus four for a partial screenshot and shift plus command plus four plus space if you want to take a windowed screenshot and now let's talk about some problems you might be facing while you want to capture a screenshot on your mac what if your keyboard is not working or specific keys aren't working which are used to capture screenshots so it's quite easy all you need to do is open launchpad go into others folder and open screenshot app and now you will have that screenshot toolbar we have just talked about and you can take your preferred size screenshot on your mac another way is open launchpad open preview app and now from the menu bar of preview app choose files and select take a screenshot and now you will have the options of how you want to take your screenshot and that's how you take screenshots on your mac even if your keyboard is not working but what if you only want to copy that particular screenshot to send it across not to save on your device then my friends next tip is for you all you have to do is just press Control command shift plus three to take a full screen screenshot and copy it to your clipboard similarly you can replace three with four if you want to take a partial screenshot and of course you can also take a windowed screenshot and copy it to your clipboard by pressing Control plus command plus shift plus four plus space all these screenshots you have just taken will be copied to your clipboard and won't be saved on your device so next thing you have to do is just paste it in a particular app in which you want to send it across i mentioned that all the captured screenshot will be saved on the desktop of your mac there's a way you can change the saved location for these screenshots so to change the default saved location for your screenshots you need to enable screenshot toolbar and to do that you need to press 
command shift and five now you need to select options and from there you can change the default save location for your screenshots well if you are still unsatisfied with all the screen capturing tools available in the mac os then my friends you need to try some third party apps monoshot and lightshot screenshot are few apps which i recommend if you want to build into third party apps to take a screenshot on your mac otherwise for me these inbuilt tools are just more than enough to cater my need now let's talk about how you can edit these screenshots either it could be taken by a third party app or natively on your mac os it is quite simple all you need to do is select a screenshot and open it with preview click on show markup toolbar and now you will have multiple options of editing your screenshots you can write on it you can add blur you can erase things or you can hide it as well on your screenshots by using these markup tools and that is how you edit these screenshots on your mac and lastly let's talk about if you are facing any problem while taking screenshots on your mac as in pressing those shortcuts are resulting into nothing then my friends you need to check out your settings and to do that you need to press on apple icon at the top left corner of your mac choose system setting now click on keyboard select keyboard shortcuts choose screenshots and now make sure that you have checked marked or selected each and every shortcut out there if not then these shortcuts might won't work for you and you won't be able to take screenshots using these shortcut method and you can also restore these shortcut keys if they are changed by someone or by yourself in the past and might be resulting into an error while taking a screenshot i hope this guide was helpful for all the people who were earlier struggling to take a screenshot on your mac but i think i have solved each and every doubt of your guys if i haven't there is still one left then do make sure that you comment down it below and while you're down there make sure you like the video subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any amazing helpful content like this and one more thing go to app store download igb app and enjoy everything apple content and amazing wallpapers on this note this is me samir signing off and i'm gonna see you in the next one till then tata see ya bye